daughter of Zion, behold, your Savior is coming, riding on a colt. Palm Sunday is the fulfillment of the prophecy of Prophet Zechariah. A very significant event in the life of Christ was the triumphal entry into Jerusalem. People with waving branches of palm welcomed him, singing Hosanna. This was an enchanting occasion for his followers and for us it is a reminder of accepting Jesus into our lives. We celebrate this event on Palm Sunday during liturgy with procession of palm leaves of the date palm or twigs from the locally available leaves. Hosanna is a liturgical word which means the shout of jubilation in recognition of the Messiah and an appeal for the divine help of the Saviour. On this occasion, I would like to highlight the humility of Jesus Christ. Jerusalem Temple was the pride of people, gleamed with its splendour and beauty. Jesus, in contrast, came in humility with a call to salvation. Why did he decide to ride on the back of a donkey? He wanted to teach us the only path of victory over evil is the royal road of humility. The anointed king of David chose for his vehicle a common beast of burden. It was amazing. His friends who accompanied him were not with swords but with palm branches. The monument of his victory erected a week later was not an arch but a crucifix. His earthly beginning was frightfully humble. He was born into the stench of a stable, haunted by Herod's henchmen, and grew up in far-flung province of Roman Empire. His disciples were not men of ability and culture. They were drawn from the very low background of the backwater region. He humbled himself in his birth, ministry and death. The second Adam had to undo the damage caused by the first one. Palm Sunday is also called as the Passion Sunday, the sweet sour moments with the glimpse of the glory and suffering. He knew about his imminent death, yet he perceived it quietly to teach us how we might live in hard times. Jesus, being the Son of God, was overwhelmed with grief in the Garden of Gethsemane, the one who listened more than he spoke. This is the Jesus of Palm Sunday. The enslaved African Americans composed a tender, beautiful hymn. In it dwells a vivid disclosure of penetrating the reverent feeling that evokes pity or sadness. It begins with the question, Were you there when they crucified my Lord? Were you there when they nailed him to a tree? The answer is yes, a definite yes from you and me. Yes, I was there in the crowd, shouting Hosanna and then crucify him. My dear sisters, let us be the people of Hosanna by our forgiving love and humble service. Wish you all the blessings of Palm Sunday. Thank you.